Give me a goddess's work to do, and I will do it. I will even stoop to a queen's work if you will share the throne with me. But do not pretend that people become great by doing great things. They do great things because they are great if the great things come along, but they are great just the same if the great things do not come along. If I never did anything but sit in this room and powder my face and tell you what a clever fool you are, I would still be heavens high above the millions of common women who do their domestic duties, sacrifice themselves, run trade departments, and all the rest of the vulgarities. Has any of the tedious public work you have done made you any the better? I have seen you before and after your boasted strokes of policy, and you were the same man, and would have been the same man to me and to yourself if you had never done them. <laughs> I thank God my self-consciousness is something nobler than vulgar conceit in having done something. It is what I am, not what I do, that you must worship in me. If you want deeds, go to your men and women of action, as you call them, who are all in a conspiracy to pretend that the mechanical things they do, the foolhardy way they risk their worthless lives, they're getting up in the morning at four, working 16 hours a day for 30 years like coral insects, makes them great. <laughs> what are they for? These dull slaves. To keep the streets swept for me. <laughs> to enable me to reign over them in beauty like the stars without having anything to do with their slavery except to console it, to dazzle it, to enable them to forget it in adoring dreams of me. Am I not worth it? Look into my eyes and tell me the truth. Am I worth it or not?